Erin Gruel always says, teach one to teach another. That's exactly what I do in my teacher cadet classes at Dutch Fork High School in Irmo, South Carolina, as I use freedom writer strategies to teach high school seniors interested in the teaching profession, hoping that they too will one day teach one to teach another. From day one, these students begin growing their teacher heart. I use freedom writer activities and games like the bingo, crayon, and peanut self-reveal to build community while breaking down cliques and barriers. The line game shows students they are more alike than different, and their community service opens their hearts to the needs of others beyond our walls. The toast for change empowers them, and the yarn tie encourages and lifts them. All of our activities include self-reflection for personal growth. Students bring their growing heart throughout the year into defending the bullied, helping the lost, and befriending the lonely. They put that into practice with a two-month internship in a real classroom. Teach one to teach another is more than a saying or an inscription. It embodies everything the Freedom Rider method is about. As Margaret Mead once said, never doubt that a group of thoughtful, committed citizens can change the world. Indeed, it's the only thing that ever has. Freedom Rider teachers are committed to doing just that.